but I'm down to watch some NEC. Got permission to do the restream. So NEC Northeast Championship. We got uh does he go by the fish or the instrument? Pro bass fishing. Okay, bass, MJ, Stingrays. Not familiar with that player versus Idom. Somehow they let Casa Bunch. Bunch actually snuck into a top eight, which is crazy. This man's supposed to be a retired TO. What's going on here? Versus Shin Joni, not familiar with them either. And Jay Wong and Escaping Jail. Escaping Jail's a good DJ player. So should be a good time. I'm betting on Idom taking it. I mean, <laughs> that's just my opinion, but. Oh, everyone left. Chair stream all around. What is Justin doing there? Get that man off the mic. He has a top eight to play. All right. Two. A Kim Mirror in top eight. What's going on here? I noticed the crowd is rooting for him. Yeah. Yeah. I wonder if this is from the hometown. Hometown Philly. Oh, you didn't check it. I am thankful that I do not play with Street Fighter 6 music on. But then I watched one with like Shine playing or something, and I kept hearing her level 3 song, and I was like, this song sucks. <laughs> and you have to hear it every time she does level 3. I also remember hearing JP's theme on a match one time, and I'm like, what the hell is this? Took me a minute to piece it together. I was like, wait, that's fucking JP's theme? Why does Kim listen to game show music? Yeah, I feel like they totally missed <laughs> what this would be. Where is she from? She's from the Bronx, and that's what she's listening to? I, I think Capcom is... They might be mistaken. <laughs> if anything, it would be some Wu-Tang shit. New York. Influence from from Bushin style, some ninja influence. Liquid swords, maybe. Liquid swords is more has more like. Uh, ninja action movie influence to me. All right, MJ. I guess it's more samurai than ninja. It's not really a ninja influence. It's more like samurai for Liquid Swords. I'm not tripping. Don't worry. I look at the wiki. I guess Wu-Tang has a lot more samurai themes than ninja. I went to NEC back in 2016, and I ended up getting ninth with Nikali. I ended up being sent to losers by Justin Wong himself, and then losing to Shine and losers. Shine eliminated me from the bracket at ninth place, but he took the hit for when he went to NEC top eight. When he went to top eight the next day, he's the one who sat down and the whole thing collapsed. It could have been me. <laughs> there, he's showing off the $3 shape up. <laughs> and then look at the, the desk over there. It just goes it just goes full of trapezoid on him. <laughs> dodged one. Dodged a bullet there. So that that's NEC lore for you guys. Alright, what do we got? Idom. Yeah, Mena said it. Manon's secretly top tier. Manon's uh Idom's about to prove it. Secret top tier Manon. Oh, double perfect parry back to back. Jump, heavy kick from Manon. It's so tough. Not quite a dive kick, but it's almost there. You, you have to anti her so early. It hits so early in the jump arc. Oh, you got like one guess left, man. Okay. Yeah, shut down this top tier character, Ken. Let's go, Stingrays. Anon's too cheap. Yeah, let's go. He's dead. Finally, an honest mid tier Ken prevailing over the oppressive cheap command grab using top tier. Manon S plus plus tier. Yeah, people just don't know know it yet. Oh, actually, that's a good level three. That's actually a really good level three. Look at the drive meter situation. Oh, look at that. Oh, see, it's so hard to anti her, but no, that lack of anti cost him almost a guaranteed win. He's going to drive rush in. What an empty spin. Oh, wait, he wins. Wow. One O oh, steam race. The guilty gear champ has dropped a game. Item on guilty gear. Yeah, he's a testament player. Item. Wait a minute. Oh, good tech. Steam is playing very solid. 
Oh, he doesn't have the DPs though for the, the, the jump dive kick from Anon. Wow, lucky wake up tag. Wow, command grab punish for the metal. Is like, man, you're a grappler. You need to overextend, right? Sometimes, you know? Get this guy, Jay Wong, off the mic. He's in top eight. Oh, perfect parry? Hold that. He's in top eight. He has to play after this match. Let me see it. Five medallion stallion. Oh, you're scared. Focus on the game. We got to see some more Aki. That hidden fr <laughs> thing where I was like, hmm, oh, right. Yeah, you can't cross up in the corner. I uh, I forgot about that small detail. Oh, my God. Uh, items warmed up. He's looking clean. Here I come. Delay. Level one. Not enough, though. But you got to guess for game. Yeah, back off. We got the real state on hmm. We don't even need Oh, it. my God. He's actually playing footsies. Okay. Okay. Stingrays. Oh, he just guessed DI. What a scrub. If he used the DI mechanic, he must be a scrub. That's how it works. Oh my god, big damage. Oh, you're de are you dead? Oh, could you not cancel on that final hit? Oh, it don't even matter. Is random DI actually could start at the highest level? Uh, he was doing it, he predicted the EX fireball. He kind of guessed on a fireball from Stingrays. I was speaking facetiously. In jest. Oh, he tried to do it again, but not this time. Good counter DI. Oh, I thought that was going to drop for a second. Nice conversion. Stingrace staying alive. One round away from tying it up. He's actually, he's really in this. This is serious. This is serious. Oh, nice, nice check. Oh, he is ready, but he, he forced the burnout out of out of him. But he's still like a guess away. Yeah, now he can, now he can use DI to build space. Oh, oh, he's still got the punish. He's gonna he's gonna go into burnout. Oh, he doesn't have cross cuts. I think Stingray's one weakness is his anti air game. He's not as as crispy with the DPS. I don't notice that, but this is still. Items about to go down. It's supposed to be 2 2. It is 2 2. Holy shit. I did not. Let me put some respect on Stingray's name. I did not expect this whatsoever. He's doing a lot of heavy kicks. I'm a little scared he's going to eat a DI from Stingray's. Oh, wait. He's going to get the level 2. No, he goes for the metal. No EX. He definitely could have EX flipped that. Oh my god. He didn't get the combo? None of that comboed. Stingrays are so scared of command grab. None of that comboed. Those were just random peppered in buttons. Oh, can you get a trade combo from that? I don't seem like I, I, I'm expecting, suspecting that you can. I mean, I feel like you would have only gone for the drive rush cancel if you knew that you can get a trade combo. Didn't work out. He needs the level three. Item has a Ken problem in this game. For some reason, a lot of people have a Ken problem in this game. Oh, that was footsies. Don't drop the input. GG's. That was footsies. Manon doesn't get the best whiff punish damage in the game. It's like not that great in a lot of situations, but Idom definitely definitely has a whiff punish. That was a good set. Props to Stingrays, man. I have not heard of him prior to this, but he played really solid. What is this? Ryu? He's been playing modern Ryu the whole weekend? Come on now. Modern Ryu? Oh! He didn't combo to Super? Wait, wait. No, he could have just blocked. He wasn't going to get shipped. How much ship does a level 2 do? That is so strong to have. C green, do modern DP. But DJ. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Modern reactions. That's gotta be a little tough. When you're used to playing against Classic as DJ, and then you go up against Modern, you gotta switch gears. You cannot use Drive Rush the same way you normally do. He's laughing too. If you Modern Reaction level three to DJ Drive Rush, of course you'd be laughing. You'd at least have a smirk, minimum. Oh, that was a bit much. That was a bit much. You put yourself in burnout. Wait a minute. 
Okay, he spends it early. I think more optimal would have been to keep him not in burnout for longer. Because DJ level 1 is not invincible. But he has the corner. Oh, jump back like it. This is old man shit. He's, he's just waiting to modern level 3. Don't drive rush at him. Don't, yeah, back sway. Don't drive rush at him. Oh, nice shimmy. Oh, you didn't convert? Nice, nice reaction. Oh, big punish. 69 every time. I think this might be the end of the modern Ryu vid. The content end tier. He is getting mauled. He is getting mauled. Oh, do it again. Plus frames. Oh my god. Escaping jail is feeling it. Oh, he couldn't combo from that? He dropped. What is that on block, actually? The two hit Sobot kick? Oh, Justin, that was a bad use of meter. Yeah, it's actually going to make him go out of burnout faster. Yeah, he's going to get chipped. Oh, smart sequence, actually. Good stuff to escaping jail, though. Listen, it's easy to lose your composure. You're going up against Justin Wong, and he picks fucking modern Ryu against you. It would be easy to choke under the pressure, because Justin was legit good, and then it's also kind of a trolley pick. Good stuff to escaping jail. Trying to see what happens with Bunch's match? Yeah, who let Bunch sneak in the top eight? What is going on here? Did, wait, did they DQ Bunch? They DQ'd Bunch. This TO got DQ'd. All right, we got some Aki. Let's go. Stingray impressed me, though. We'll see if uh, Shinjoni can keep up. Stingray is kind of cooking right now. Oh, I like the slide. Nah, uh, too a little too late. There you go. Okay, Stingray is showing his anti airs are stronger than they appeared against Idom. Level three? Stingray is steamrolling right now. Not gonna lie. Ryan needs to switch to modern controls of them chopsticks. Man, struggle with the noodles. Who doesn't struggle when you're down into the last few noodles, okay? I'm sorry. This is what I'm working with. These the tiny bits of noodles left. Uh, Trajan, FGC, thanks for the prime. Yeah, when you're down to the last bit of the noodles, you scoop them with your mouth and slurp like an animal. Exactly. This is how it works. Oh, you made it out? Oh, ah! No, you're getting pieced up. Oh, he's going out like that. I love the drive rush punish, though. Parry to drive rush to, for optimal damage. Shinjoni wasn't ready. He wasn't ready. Stingray, though, is looking clean. Bass and escaping jail. So, yeah, escaping jail. Uh, I, he entered... Full Bar Friday's the Texas Regional All Nine event. That was like the only Street Fighter Six tournament I've managed to win, and uh, he was really good. Definitely the hardest opponent I had in the tournament. <laughs> Kicked her out of the air. Ah, oh, that drive rush cancel. I do not agree with that, but it's it's okay. It's okay. Is it okay? It's not okay. It's not okay. You should have kept yourself not in burnout because you could have got the you could have got a. Oh. Let her hit the ground. Let her hit the ground. Let her hit the ground. No, you should have let her hit the ground. Oh my god. Okay. I think DJ can set up from that route a meaty EX fireball to chip. That would have been fine. I feel like he should have left, let her hit the ground and done a meaty DI reset when she had zero bar. Um, but even then, once he did the combo and spent all the bar, he should have done meaty EX fireball. He did crouching medium into it, and he could have done wake up level one. Oh my god, escaping jail is cooking though. Yeah, escaping jail is definitely a flow player. Oh, he's mashing, just like Justin said, he's mashing the crash medium kick. That is a real strategy with a lot of characters. In this game, it's really hard to do strings that are good block strings and then create space outside of the opponent to set up spacing traps where their common buttons will whiff. So because you're always negative at the end of your strings, uh, Ken, you know, uh, Cammy, DJ, it's very common for them to just mash crouch and medium kick at the end of your string because you can't really do anything. You're negative, so you just have to hold down back. Jury. Yeah, all the low forward cancel characters. Oh, he was desperate. So yeah, escaping jail, mashing, crouching, medium kick there, it makes sense. And Ken players do it all the time. Like, I've noticed that. Like, you, you when you end your string, you have to hold down back. You kind of have to hold down back. 
Oh, yeah, he said the, he said the double thumbs up twice now. I think this might be his first like offline on stream top eight. Maybe I'm wrong, but it, he's giving me the vibe that he's just happy to be there. Like he's having a good run. He's on stream. I remember watching Escaping Jail on stream 15 years ago, playing Blast Blue Calamity Trigger. I take it back then. Escaping Jail is an OG. Maybe he for 15 years he's been hitting the thumbs up. I Dom versus MJ. Top tier Manon and Kimberly in winners finals here at NEC. Here we go. Winners finals. Street Fighter 6 meta is so stale, dude. Look at all these characters. Damn, Idom's already up 2-0 on MJ, though. What a beast. Oh, what a check. Idom's drive rush checks are actually so good, but with Manon, you barely get any reward unless you do standing medium punch. MJ said give him the lead. Yeah, I'd rather my opponent start up 2-0 against me in winner's finals because... I don't want to. I don't want to win my set for free. I'm on that grind set right now. If I don't th reverse 3-0 my opponent, did I even deserve to win? All right, 3-0. It's over with a perfect. Good winners finals item. Well played. Yeah, get the throws in. He's 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 pairing. Oh, big shimmy. Spray can. Oh, it was meaty. You're dead. Oh, he wasn't ready. The the lights were too bright. I love the two jabs. That's a common situation where I mess up. It's I need to chain cancel the jabs to make sure my DI comes out rather than just pressing one jab into DI. Wait a minute. Item do be doing supers. Footsies. Oh, he landed the meaty, but still got the shimmy as well. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay. Oh, good check. Oh, that's the cheesy mix. Okay. Oh, he whiffed. You whiffed. You're giving Adam a chance here. Yeah, he has no way to avoid this, really. Oh, he ate the jump. Oh, there was a lot of decision making happening in that that last two seconds. He was trying to avoid burnout by eating the hits. He could have gone for perfect parry. Then there was the scramble. Just too much, too much going on. Oh, oh good confirm. So he he did, uh, what is that? Back heavy punch confirm into the EX ballerina kick. That is to, to confirm if people get hit airborne for trying to jump away from the command grab. That was actually really good. It's a hit confirm. Okay, guys, I snoozed the ad. We'll avoid it for this set. Overhead, counter hit confirm. Meaty? Oh, oh no. You have two command grabs worth of damage left. You're dead. That is... Was well, it death? I think it's dead. Justin says it's dead. GG's 3-0. I didn't even need to delay that ad. The ad would have started right now. Item, so content conscientious. Conscientious? Conscientious. What? How do you speak? Consciousness. That's not what I want. Conscience. Conscientious. 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 Why can't I say that? Conscientious. English is so trash, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, anytime I mispronounce a word or, or flub a word, I should just get pissed at, at English. All right, we got loser semis, escaping jail versus Stingray. They've been playing really good, both of these players. Punish? Oh, okay. Well, things fell apart there. He should have been dead. Big DI. He just guessed with it. Side swap? Level two? Oh, he should have level two, dude. Oh, okay. It's working out. It's working out. I feel like he should have level two. Yeah, I think you have to super Oh, he was buffering. Oh, and the kill. That was clutch. That was clutch. Yeah, that is plus. Oh my god, you really did that? He was negative there, took his turn back with the EX uh, up kicks. What does he have? Oh, that still killed? I cannot predict the amount of damage that level 2 is going to do. It does RNG damage. Are you just exposing yourself for not having the rhythm? I don't know, man. This seems to do random amounts of hits and damage. I don't know. Kind of weird game design. Oh, big meaty? Yeah, Stingray's just not blocking. Nice DI. 
That was a good DI. Oh! He did a little bit of a jiggle forward, which gave him enough space to get the cross up. He could have stayed back. Okay, what do you got? Cornered. Low drive meter. Oh, nice shimmy. Team Grace is serious? Oh, what, what's, what's, he's hamming it up for the camera right now. Keep it down. No fun allowed. You can have the fun after the win. Just kidding. But I do like to ignore my opponents if they're having fun during tournament. <laughs> just be like, oh, I didn't hear you after. Nice punish. I like that idea. That was a good punish because it just gives the guaranteed burnout and to the guaranteed DI because he has no meter. Kind of miscalculated on the combo though. Oh, took his turn back. Okay. Okay. Nice. Wow. <laughs> Oh my god. What a button. That back dash was nice, though. That was very clutch. I, I like Stingrays. Stingrays is actually very solid. I'm impressed. Big burnout. Is he going to level two? You got to go for the DI. You got to test his reactions. Did you bait it in time? Oh, that's the setup. Stingrays. Clean. How did Idom beat this dude? What the fuck? Yeah, I never would have expected Idom to beat Stingrays 110. Oh! I don't know how that target combo ends. Is there, is there another way he could have got more damage there? I'm not familiar with DJ's target combos. Nice answer to the Jinrai. Just a checkmate situation there with the uh, OD upkicks. That was very good from Escaping Jail. Wait a minute, Escaping Jail. What do you got? Okay, guaranteed answer. Very good. Yeah, it's not it's not a bad trade for Stingrays. Cause look at the drive meter situation. Like he didn't get that much off that OD upkicks. Oh, he's dead. Oh, sh movement. Yeah, but see, it's guaranteed answer. Yeah, I agree. It's, that's a situational answer because it's too meter costly. That, that gave Stingrays the win. Yeah, it's over. GG's. Good run from Escaping Jail, though. Good set. I'm a fan of Escaping Jail's DJ. This is the marathon now for Stingrays. That was Loser's Semis. He's going up to Loser's Finals. If he's going to win the tournament, it's four sets straight, including that one. I'm biased now. I like Stingrays' play. Kind of rooting for Stingray right now. Big parry? Into the corner. Like if you just do dry rush throw, it seems like he would just take punish counter throws all day. I agree with Jay Wong's assessment. Some players you run into, and it's almost annoying how much they perfect parry your dry rushes. So you really need to just do dry rush throw on them to force them to not immediately parry. And then you can mix in buttons because then they'll try to interrupt your dry rush with buttons, and then you can press early buttons to punish their anti dry rush button attempt. Is that, is that enough? Oh my god, the level 3 chips, chip damage in this game is absurd. I like that fireball, that was a nice punish on the, the elbow drop. Okay, wait a minute. Can he set up the can here? Oh, he could have thrown him. I mean, hindsight's 2020. Oh, does he have to confirm? Alright, good stuff from MJ. Oh, that was a big whiff punish. Oh! I do feel like MJ needs to throw Stingrays more. Ah, uh, nice clip. Damn. Come on, Stingrays. He could have he could have DP through the that jump in. The one gap I'm seeing in Stingrays gameplay is he got, he's just like lacking a little bit of awareness of when he could DP. Oh, nice check. Yes. So. If you block the stand medium kick from uh, Kimberly, for the most part, you should just always mash jab. Because if she cancels to the run, you will interrupt the run. If she dry rush cancels, though, then it, your jab doesn't come out, and then you get to deal with the mix-up after. Level 2? Yes, sir. So yeah, for sure, when you block uh, stand medium kick from Kimberly, look for the run. You can jab and, and get a counter hit. Oh, meaty. That was meaty. 
Oh! Oh, you should have thrown! It was a jab! Oh, and you're dead. 69 every time. That could have been big, though. He could have back thrown him there on the punish counter on the perfect parry. Oh, footsies. That was an expert with punish. That was expert. I like that. That was an expert with punish. Okay, good check. Yeah, he has been checking those runs. Take that. Clean. I feel like MJ really needs to push the offense here and there. Just drive rush cancel from an MK and force a mix up. Especially when you're cornered, it builds space. Yeah, what's the uh, what's the game plan here? He's got the bar. You need to make the comeback. Oh, he tried to bait it right there. Oh, you just eat the jump back. When people are scared of the super, it's actually not a bad idea to do the jump back. They're gonna try to not overcommit on their offense and try to do things that are like delayed. So a jump back is actually not bad in that situation. Mm -hmm. Big, there we go. Look, like I haven't seen a DP out of Sting Race in years. Final round. I need those big 690 channel points. What? <laughs> the fireball broke DI. Sting Race did not even see that coming. Oh, pick up. Oh, on the elbow into the level three. The highlight reel finish. Is he dead? There's no way he's dead, right? Oh, that was sick. That was actually a sick pickup. I think he could have optimized it more to kill. But that was definitely the highlight reel. DI's, uh, MJ doesn't have enough life to counter DI, but wait a minute. Your highlight reel may, might be spoiled. Hold up. Oh, meaty DI, you weren't ready? Oh, he did it, because that's what I'm saying. If he just automatically, if he just committed to the drive rush cancels, he would have won. After the first one connected, he's like, wait, I should have drive rush canceled. And he did it with the second one and it was too little too late. How much did I win? Plus 754. So what, I gained uh, 84 points. Let's go. I went all in on Stingrays. Stingrays never let me down. All right, we doing a prediction? Will Stingray reset in grand finals? All right, Stingray, you never let me down. I'm going all in on no. <laughs> I'm going all in on no, he will not reset Grand Finals. Now listen, I'm sorry, Manon is too cheap. Mena told me that Manon is stronger than the world knows right now. Idom's about to prove it. He's like, he's he's just saying, you know what, Mena, you're right. I've been pretending to not win. It was all just a, the long con, a big ruse. And we're about to see right now, Idom's about to prove to the world that Manon is broken in top tier. Which is, uh, you know, it's a, it's a one-to-one -one correlation, right? You, if you're top tier, you're broken. That's just how it works. And if you're good, you're just a little bit broken. If you're top five, you're broken. If you're top 10, you're just slightly broken. If you're top 15, you're broken sometimes. Anyways, this is a bad start for, for Stingray. <laughs> This is actually the worst way to start. No, it's not the worst way. It's almost the worst way. Idom had four medals and a perfect. It could have been five medals and a perfect. Okay. Oh, and the low forward. See, sometimes you just got to commit to the cancel. Especially when you're drive meter full. Oh my God. Idom is guessing with the slides right now. Oh God. Next command grab, you're dead. Yep. Yeah. Either way you go about it. You you eat the low, you die. You eat the command grab, you die. And what? La, 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 That's actually scary right there. Hey, I ain't gonna lie, Jay. Y'all sound mad creepy, though. Like, like, <laughs> I, I like it's kind of good. Justin oh, just brought out the horror movie version of Manon's theme. Like, it should be sung by a choir of creepy children voices. Ooh, Who are you rooting for, JoJo? Do you like Manon, JoJo? Who loves wrestling? Oh, my God. You are being harassed, Ingrace. Oh, you could have level three that. Ah, he missed the opportunity. When you jump into a DI, you have a lot of time to buffer. If you're gonna jump back, press a button in the corner when you're in burnout, you need to be buffering your level three. I thought for sure Idom was about to eat the level three right there. Ah, oh, man, Idom is cooking, but on is too busted. Oh, he's Idom is just playing kind of kind of clean. He's Idom's kind of a good gamer. Is uh, the Guilty Gear NEC champ about to go home with two trophies today? Big whip punish. Command grab will kill. What's what's the mix? 
Oh, he, he didn't get the, the buffer. I want to be wrong. He's fishing the whole time. He's fishing. Look. The footsie range is very, very apparent from Idom here. Oh, what a whiff punish. He's just out nuching you, Stingrays. I'm sorry. Oh, oh, okay, good for both of them. I thought Idom doing perfect parry to heavy kick was so clean, and then Stingrays DI, DIs him instantly. <coughs> He's almost in burnout. What do you got? Oh, oh. Oh, you got yourself killed? Crosscut? Okay, you have it. You have those. No! That's how you're gonna lose? That's how the tournament's gonna end? I dom. You know, thank you for not doing the level three, I dom. You saved time. I know you gotta go home to New York. That's how the tournament ended? You thought EXDB was gonna chip? What happened there? He thought this was gonna kill? Really? He was kind of close. It should have chipped? What do you mean it should have chipped? What do you mean it should have chipped? Was there a weird circumstance here that caused this to do less damage? Really? Really? Okay. 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 Really? Okay. Really? One of the hits missed in the beginning. Really? 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 It normally does two hits. So that happened. So that did how much chip? 300? So that did 300 chip. And normally it would do 550 chip. Oh, it actually does a way more chip. This, it should have chipped. The, the chatter wasn't lying. So 370, okay, if you're crouching, it'll do 375. So it'll do 375 if you're crouching and all the hits hit. If you're standing, it hits an extra final hit that does 550. But if it's space, it is 300. So maybe that 75 damage was the difference, because imagine he's crushing. Yeah, if you, if you block the last hit standing, it does way more damage. That's good to know. So I get why he did EXDP, he just miscalculated, and the spacing was funny. All right, well, congrats to Idom, Manon's cheap, and uh, good run from Stingrace. I'm a fan. Well played.